Hey guys, and welcome to Season 1, Episode 7 of How Far Is Chat Too Far? I picked this episode because it was called Down in the Dumps, which leads me to assume someone got a poo tattooed on them, probably. But the premise of this show is essentially two friends or whatever going together, and they each, like, design a tattoo for the other, and then the other person has the tattoo, and then they reveal it. Super exciting stuff. The hosts of the show are Snooki from Jersey Shore and Nico Tortorella. I don't know who that is. He is an American actor and he was known for his roles in Scream 4. Is this the guy that was on How Far Is Tattoo Far? Are we sure? Yeah, I think that looks like him. But anyway, let's just see what this show is all about. I don't think I would trust a guy that's slamming his head up against a watermelon for a video. Is this- is he getting tasered at a party? Yep, nothing's too far. You would not catch me dead. Going into a tattoo with someone who's smashing their head up against- Like, what is this? Is he Mike the Situation from Jersey Shore? You know, where he's smashing his head against the concrete wall in Italy? What the heck, bro? <laughs> And this kid's like, hey, like, light yourselves on fire. We'll dip our shirts in gas, like, really make it light. His shirt went up way fast. Okay, but did they, did they literally set themselves on fire? I mean, I didn't see, I don't know, a video. Like, they showed the one dude slamming his head into the watermelon. Surely they would show them setting themselves on fire for a video, right? He jackhammered his toe. Let's see it. Come on, take it out. No! Connor, your toe, it's freaking nasty, dude. Why did it show his toe, though? I did not need to see that. I was moving furniture, and I was baked out of my mind. We were moving the bookcase from one room to another, and it pushed up against my toe, and my whole toenail came off. So I've experienced that, but that shit grows back, bro. It's totally fine now. My toe would be looking like a toe, you know? Like, why does his foot still look like that? Has he seen a doctor? Surely they would have taken the nail out or something, and then it would have just grown back. What the heck? Gross, bro. The tattoo that I'm giving him is gonna be reminding him she's using you for your body, man. Okay, I mean, what? Like, is he gonna put a, put a little tattoo with a slut on him? And he's gonna do something with the jackhammer and the toe? That's... Is the tattoo gonna be on the toe? I would imagine that would be not pleasant, and I would feel sorry for the tattoo artist doing the toe tattoo. Ew. If my friend put this tattoo on my body, I'd amputate my leg. You wanna run that by me again, Jordan? We're gonna put it right... Here. Okay, at least the tattoo is going on his butt, so he's like no one's gonna be looking at his butt very often, I assume. And at least the other guys is going on the toe, but like I'm tired of seeing this dude's toe. Just get your toe away from me, okay? Ew! Ew! <laughs> yeah, okay, that does look like I don't know. I think this would also be easy to like tattoo over if you had to. But like, yeah, that's gross. I'm tired of seeing these man feet. I'm gonna blur those toes so you don't gotta suffer through those toes. But just know that that is, you know, pretty bad, but not as bad as these freaking toes, bro. I swear. It's awful out here. But he's not wearing pants. Dude got to take care of his feet, bro. And also, that tattoo was pretty light. So I think as long as I didn't do like all black outline and stuff, I think it'd be easy to cover up if it's that big of a deal. But like, when your feet look like that, I don't think it matters. No, not her name. He tattooed her name. Oh no. This is probably like hands down the worst. Like, I thought it was gonna I thought it was gonna be something gross. Oh, I would be furious. And it's dark colors. Like I said, this is gonna be hard to tattoo over without it looking like absolute trash. Oh my god. Dude. Also, I'm gonna have to blur a bunch of his butt. There's not much there, so don't worry, you're not missing anything. <laughs> oh, and it's all so dark. Oh, it's all so dark. And it's not even a good tattoo. What does it say? Incoming call. She was my first and only girlfriend. Try to stay clear from those girls, you know? Like, never date a It's not even spelled right. I don't know how to spell it. How do you spell it? Two E's at the end. He spelled it wrong, and who spells Mandy with two E's? That's the most ridiculous way I've ever heard anybody spell Mandy. What are you, a manatee? Because Man manatees have two E's at the end. Manatee. 
Mandy the Manatee. That sounds like a great kid's book about manatees, probably. Or a show about manatees. And, like, one in particular named Mandy. But, like... At least they spelled it wrong so it's not as traumatizing, but it's so dark, it's gonna be so hard to get off. And I'm also very curious about what the ladies did. So someone's gonna have a turd. Some woman out there has a tattoo turd right on them. Hey y'all, I'm Brene. I'm here with my sister Jasmine. Jasmine was popular, she was always able to talk to people. She's been in her shadow a long I time. Aww. I don't believe it's like that. I know it's one of Jazz's biggest insecurities, so I'm gonna help her out with that. Is it gonna be something absolutely terrible? What the hell, bro? Our relationship might be <laughs> Tattoo is actually gonna go on your back. Is it like pointing out her back rolls or back knee or something? Good luck. Good luck. No! There's boobs on my back. It's a good thing. No, this is not a good thing. This is a detailed portrait of some boobs on my goddamn back. I know, that is like high quality. No! Figured it had to be something to do with their weight. Dude, that is so messed up. She's like, this is something you've always wanted. You've always wanted big old titties on your back. And it's, again, it's another hard, dark tattoo that it's gonna be hard to cover up. Look at these boobs, these back boobs. This lady's gonna have these boobs there forever. And like, like the bra strap, like if she did it in like a light pink color with like light white bra straps, like it would be easier to cover. But like, look at all those dark lines, bro. Oh my god, I'm stressed out for this lady. She got back boobs for the rest of her life. Or she gonna have to get a really big dark tattoo on her back to cover up these back boobs. I don't know, I would have made it more proportional where it's like, you know, it actually got her back rolls because this just looks weird. At least the other way would have been more realistic. <laughs> Do you want your back boobs to be more realistic or like this? This is what I gotta live with for the rest of my life. It, I got boobs on my back. I tell you what, she's taking it like a champ though. <laughs> like I guess what would you do at that point? You got back titties. Everybody got back titties now, you know? <laughs> well maybe not everybody, but everybody that gets titties tattooed on their back will have back titties. She probably like invented a trend this day. <laughs> Why'd you put this on me? Kiss me, my sister's gay. So I know what he had poop tattooed on them. Well, this was called down in the dumps for nothing. I took it to literally boo. She got kiss me. My sister's gay. That's it. The other one got fake boobs. This is what I this was the last one. This one's lame. She kind of deserved it by having tattooed titties on her sister. <laughs> Tattoo back titties, not even front titties. So you don't even get quad tit, you get back tit. You're not gay for real. You gay for real? Yes. I'm your sister. I'm gonna love you regardless. Is she tattooed titties on your back, bro? Why did she do that? I don't understand. That lady has back titties now. Forever. For the rest of her life. And they're dark. Like, the dark straps. That's gonna be so hard to cover up. I don't know if I can forgive someone if that thing gave me titties on my back. But also, like, yeah, I don't think announcing on someone's skin that you're gay is probably the way to do it. I don't know. I need to think about this. Goodbye.